Hello, it's Michael, and today we're planting the seeds. Seedlings, so let's take a look. If you remember, we did a little bit of a comparison. We didn't change the pH of one of these, and we've got a sim very similar germination success rate and very similar growth. So I'll just talk about putting these in a system. So we'll, I'm sure you all know how to put them in soil systems. You dig a little hole, you place the seed in, you press down, and then you water. Um, the next one is, oh, I'll show you, is the NFT. So this is NFT. What you've got is you've got channels with a little bit of water running down them. And you can either put put the seeds in these little mesh pots, which I don't like because as they grow, this you've got to bin the plastic pots. But what I find works, if you just grab the lettuce like that, and just place it in the hole it's a bit finicky sometimes so if you just get it and place it in the hole and leave the leaves sticking out it, it usually grows quite well like that and then the third one is the media beds so with these, similar to the soil you dig a little hole down to the water level best to do this when your bed's full and you push the seed in now I'll populate all the seeds I think we've got around 240 seedlings and then I'll make a I'll see you again right so we've planted in the aquaponics and soil uh, so if you take a look here the NFT is all populated the media beds are all populated the soil's populated vertical soil bits here they've all been watered and bedded in um, we didn't use all the seeds so I've put some of them back in here if we keep on a light feed and reduce the light we might be able to plant these after the other ones finish um, if you're not already watching keep an eye out to my blog on element 14 I forgot to mention as well both aquaponics systems are set up with a pH of 5.9 and EC of 1 so it'll give a good comparison. Uh, check out my blogs at element